Reese has led the charge at Gunnersville for 30 years with the same mission. Anytime we take the field, the expectation is to win, regardless of who we're playing. And that's, uh, I hope that's the expectation as long as I'm the head coach. First up is Hanley for the Wildcats. The defending 4A state champs and Gunnersville headline the AHSAA kickoff classic in Montgomery. Gunnersville players past and present can be uh, kind of proud that we got invited to play in a game like this, certainly showcase not only these guys, but our program as well. Hanley's a team with uh, great tradition, uh, well coached, probably one of the best running backs in the state. The players told me the first game against the Tigers will show where they need to improve. The Wildcats won 10 games in 2020, a wildly successful year, averaging nearly 50 points a game. We're going to try to look at what we did last year and just uh, keep doing those things that brought us success. Anything we fell short on, try to, try to improve there as well. With plenty of starters returning, Coach Reese wants a longer playoff run in 2021 after losing in round two last season. I think our offense and defense were separated by about 100 yards at the end of, of the year. So we feel like we've got the ability to run or throw the ball at any time. In order to do that, you've got to have a, a great quarterback. Cole McCarty is going to be a junior. He did a great job for us. 11 wins would put Coach at the century mark. That's the big picture. But in Gunnersville, the focus each week is getting better. When we flip on that Hanley film and see all those college prospects, that's great. Or if we flip on the film and see a, a young team with a lot of freshmen, we don't want to let that impact how we play. We're going to try to be the best version of Gunnersville we can be and get ready to go. In Gunnersville, Lyndon Blake, Way 31 Sports. Tomorrow, we